comes tomorrow, that's when. Hello, Lucky fans. It is your day, June Believer Tuesday. Roll Hot Club member right here. And in case you haven't already noticed, there's a new filming spot because today we painted my room like the rainbow room. Um, and I'm super excited because I've been wanting to do this for months. And I was so happy that my parents let me do it. But yeah, I painted it like the rainbow room. There we go. Yeah. So there's that, and this is where I'm going to be filming from now on. So I hope you guys like the new spot. And so today's video is going to be the long-awaited Christmas haul. Uh, I, I wanted to wait and do my recap of the year, and then my vlog, of course. And so after three weeks, three weeks after Christmas, here is my Christmas haul. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is the records I got. Um, I only needed three more Monkeys records to complete my collection. So of course, like any good Monkeys fan would, I put them on my Christmas list. And thankfully I got all three of them and I'm going to be showing you guys those records right now. So the first one is the Monkeys Instant Replay. Um, I'm really happy to get this because of the one, this one, as I have been wanting the other three. Or other three, well, nah. Sorry, it's late. <laughs> the other two for uh, quite a while, and they're really hard to find. So to have original copies, all three of them are, are original copies. To have original copies of all three of them are, is amazing, and I'm super happy to get this one and the other two. The next one is the Monkeys Present. Um, funny story, I was actually with my mom when she bought this. Uh, I got it. I found it. Sorry, I found it at the record store when I went to go get the Monkeys. <laughs> Good Times Plus. I'm sorry, I can't talk right now. It's really late at night and I'm trying to like get through this. And yeah. Okay. <laughs> so I was with my mom when she bought it because I was at the record store with her, obviously, getting Good Times Plus the day before my birthday on Black Friday. And I went downstairs, because it was like a two floor record store, to go check the records and see if there was anything good. And lo and behold, I stumbled upon this. It was the first time I'd ever seen it in a record store. And of course, I snapped it up. Snapped it? Snapped it up. Talk words, please make sense, child. I, of course, grabbed it and I was like, no, it's mine. I like remember just holding on to it like, with such a crazy hard grip as I was holding a good times plus the same way. And you guys don't care. But yeah, I was happy to find this and happy to get it and waiting a month for it was crazy hard because, yeah, but here it is in my hands now and I was like, wow. The next thing is the monkey's changes. Again, this one is really hard to find and to have an original copy was, is amazing. It's amazing. Words, child. It's amazing. And yeah, good album. Y'all should get it if you don't already have it. I'm going to show you guys is the monkey's cereal box records. Um, this was the thing that I wanted the most out of everything, and so to have it is amazing, and I love listening to them. They're really cool. I love them because they're squares. Of course, I love them because of the monkeys as well, but, um, all of the songs in it, it says, it's the last train of clocks to words. I never thought it peculiar. I like that song a lot. And Valerie, again, I like that one a lot too. Um, but not that much. Daydream. Daydream. Mm, words. Daydream boy for, of course. And yeah, I was super happy to get these, and I love listening to them. Mm. Alright. The next thing is going to be magazines, and... Yeah. Magazines. Okay. Well, that was awkward. The first thing is these monkeys clippings. I know it looks like there's only one, but there's more in here. And I will show them to you guys when I do my monkeys binders flip through, which has uh, clippings and stuff in it. So yeah, but I got some really cool monkeys clippings and pinups and stuff, and they're all in here. The next thing is this monkeys monthly book. It is actually not a one of words. <laughs> it's a first edition, uh, as you can see here, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it says number one. So yeah, I was really happy to get it, not only because I didn't have any Monkeys Monthly books, and I really, really wanted some, but also because it is a first edition, and I love it, and I've looked through it so many times, and I just love reading the Monkeys Monthly books, and the old magazines, and looking at the picture of the boys, and everything. And there's, of course, this beautiful picture of Davy on the back, which makes it so much better, right? The next thing is another Monkey's Monthly. This one is number six, and it has a beautiful picture of Davey on the front, which makes it even better. 
And yeah, I was really happy to get this one as well because now I have two Monkeys Monthly books and before I had none. So yeah, that was really cool to see under the tree and I was so happy to get original Monkeys. The next thing is this flip magazine from the 60s with Mickey on the cover. And again, as I said before, I love reading old magazines and it says Davy Secrets Peter's Future, Mike's Visit with the Beatles. And there's nothing about Mickey. That's sad. Oh, just kidding. All right, I'm here. All about Mickey. I don't know why I did it, but I want the rest of them. Davy's Greatest Interview. All about Mickey's Girl. Plus, oh, never mind. That's nothing about the monkeys. Just kidding. Okay, so yeah, there's that. The next thing is this 16 magazine from the 60s. I love 16 magazines. I'd have to say, of all the 1960s magazines that I have, 16 magazines are my favorite just because I love the articles in them and the covers are always something else. And there was her really good content and yeah, so let's see, what does it say about the monkeys on here? Monkeys scoop. That's all it says. But there's Peter and there's Mike and there's there's Dave. Okay. The last magazine I'm gonna show you guys is another 16 magazine from the 60s and it says Davy when his self when his cell phone when his child please stop. Okay. <sighs> Breather. Okay, Davy, when his phone call, clothes, and letter, Mickey, Davy, Peter, Mike take you into their secret lives, and then there's Davy and Mickey, and it just said, okay. The next thing is this monkey's shirt. As you can see, it has all four of them on it, but what's really cool is that their faces are made up from lyrics of different songs, so Davy's is the Dream Believer, Mickey's is Going Down, Peter's is For Pete's Sake, and Mike's is Listen to the Band. And yeah, I love that the faces are made up from the lyrics, and you probably can't see it because it's really small and really hard to see, but just trust you. Okay. This next thing kind of goes with the shirt that I just showed you, but it is, oh, please. These monkey's pants, which have their faces on the side. Um, and again, it's the same picture that's on the shirt where it's made up from the lyrics from the same songs, but yeah, it's really cool. This next thing is a monkey's bag. It has the same picture that's on the shirt of Davy and the same lyrics, but it's in blue and not purple. And then on the back is Mickey. Oh, child, please. Is Mickey with the lyrics to going down. The next thing I'm going to show you guys is posters. I got three posters. Uh, two of them are really small, and then the one's really big, and it's already up on the wall. So I will just put a picture of it in after I show you guys these two posters. Alright, the first poster I'm going to show you guys is this one of the boys doing a cute little arm thing that I don't know what it's called. But yeah, it's super cute and I can't wait to put it on the wall somewhere. Yeah, I, I really wanted to put both of these posters up, but I waited because I wanted to show them to you guys first. So yeah, okay. The next poster I'm going to show you guys is this one of them in the director's chairs. This is actually my second favorite picture of the boys, the first one being the one just above this one of them in the rainbow room that you can see if it's like, okay, okay, let's try multitasking, but oh, no, this one right here, that's my favorite picture of the monkeys, and then this one's my second favorite, and I really can't wait to put this one up either, and so this is the last monkeys poster that I got for Christmas, it is an original promo poster for Pull It from the 80s. monkeys merch but I consider it monkeys merch because the only reason I asked for it is because Davy yeah because of Davy and it is a tambourine yeah I can't do this what, what even was that child hmm. all right well there's this monkeys lanyard and it has the logo all around it yeah and I'm sure I use it for something or I'll just randomly wear it you, you know what I'm just gonna wear it for the rest of this video hmm. I did the same thing Christmas morning. I just, I wore it all Christmas morning, so. I was actually wearing this shirt on Christmas too. There's a pack. The next thing is this Davies Angels postcard, which I actually got with something else that I got for Christmas too. It came with something that I got for Christmas that I'm not gonna show you guys. But, you know what, just know that it came with it. And it's really cute, it just tells you about Davies um, Equine Foundation, and then on the back, it has a picture of Pat and then Davies Angels and it tells you how to be a sponsor to the Equine Foundation. So yeah. 
The next thing I'm going to show you guys is this Zilch button. I was super excited to get this because I've always wanted a Zilch button. And yeah, I was really happy to have it. So I got this little, you can't see it. Here we go. Oh, be like everyone else and put my hair behind it because why not? Yeah. Oh, bangs, why? Whatever. Okay, yeah. Got the Zilch button. I'm really happy to have that. This button, it's a Davies Angels button. You can't see it here. Is that there? Maybe. No. Okay. Eh. Just kidding. Alright, well, yeah, it's a Davies Angels button and it just says, uh, supporting the Davies Jones, it cry Memorial Foundation, one horse at a time, Davies Angels. <gasps> Jeez, I just dropped The next thing I'm going to show you guys is the Monkeys dolls that they released this year for the 50th anniversary. They're in a big box right here. And so I'm going to pull them out one by one and show them to you guys because pulling them all out of moth is going to stress me out. So, yeah, I will show you guys the monkey stalls. I don't even know, they're not in a specific order, so I'm just as I pull them out of the box. The first one is super Mickey, but it's mon <laughs> talk child. It is Mickey in his monkey man suit. So yeah, there's that. And then here's the back of it that shows the full set and then them and the monkey man. Peter. Okay, the next one is Peter in his monkey man suit and you guys already saw the back so I'm not going to flip it around again but yeah there's Peter he's in fact Davy in his monkey man outfit and of course you know I'm a Davy girl so having the three little miniature Davies is like the best thing ever the last monkey man one is of course my goal because well the other three are in the box and have been shown to you and it comes with a little wool hat each one of them like figures comes with a wool hat and I thought that was super cute it is green not blue what does it say? Official World's Greatest Heroes. I cannot agree more. So yeah, there's Mike with his little wool hat. I was actually really happy when I pulled this out. The next one is Davey in his suit from, of course, the famous picture of him in the director's chairs. So yeah, there's Davey in his red suit because, you know, he's Davey and he's special, I guess. <laughs> and there's the back of it. The next one is Peter. There he is. Here he is. Yeah, there's Peter. This one is Mike, and again, he has his wool hat, even though in the picture he doesn't have his wool hat. I'm not complaining, because more wool hats are awesome. So yeah, there's Mike. The last one is Mickey in his suit, and yeah. The last set of Monkey's Dolls is my favorite set of the three. It is them in their eight button shirts, inspired by the back since the last train to Clarksville. But I'm saying Dave's is inspired by Dave Jr. Okay, so yeah, and of course it has the rainbow room on it, so I don't understand how it would be inspired by Last Train, but whatever. Look at that. Rainbow room, rainbow room, full uh, hat, yeah, okay. So yeah, there's Mike in his little eight button shirt, which is coming unbuttoned, Michael. Stop. Yeah, there's Mike. <laughs> I'll show you guys the back. I don't think I showed you guys the back of the last one. The next shirt. one is Mickey in his little eight button shirt. They're all red. So yeah, there's Nick. The next one is Peter in his little A button shirt. He's in this entire flipping set. It is Davy in his A button shirt because one, you know I'm a Davy girl, and two, he's wearing this shirt and Davy and Believer. So of course it's gonna be my favorite. Yeah, there's Davy. And the last monkeys related thing that I got for Christmas that I'm going to show you guys is this. Oh, you can't see it. Okay is this monkey's necklace. It's really hard to read, but it says monkeys in some weird writing, and I love wearing it, and I freaked out the other day because I put it on the dining room table, and I thought I lost it, and I wanted to cry, but it was, I found it, and yeah, and I love wearing it. I wear it pretty much everywhere. I wear it to school. I wear it everywhere, and yeah, so there's that. That is all the monkeys related stuff I got for Christmas this year, and um, yeah, I hope you guys got a lot of cool monkeys merch for Christmas, and if you didn't, then I'm sorry. There's a tear right there. But I hope you all got at least one monkey thing for Christmas, because at least one monkey thing for Christmas makes the whole Christmas awesome. So yeah, hope you all got awesome monkeys merch, and I will see you next Tuesday. I will. I think the paint fumes are starting to mess with my brain. Okay. <laughs> I will see you guys next Tuesday. Keep doing dream believing. Have a lovely Tuesday and safe Texas burger chicken.